Okay, everybody. We're going to do a video here. Um, uh, we're going to start with the TV series and my DVD collection. I don't know. I just felt like doing the DVDs. I'm a little bored here. Um, the first season I got here is Kenny vs. Spenny Season 1. It's a great season. There's lots of episodes. and it's really cool, as you can see, people. It's really cool. Uh, pick that up if you're a fan of anything Kenny vs. Spenny. Season one's always good, but I don't need uh, season two, three, and four. Um, the next one is a classic show, uh, in my opinion, is Seinfeld season four, which is a great season. It's a great show. Like, be uh, like, be honest. Um, I gotta get the other seasons. I think there's seven seasons, nine seasons. I need uh, all my, uh, all eight seasons. I need eight seasons out of them. Uh, hopefully, I'll get that one day. Uh, Check this out, guys. Check it out. Everybody's probably seen this show. Come on. Um, next one, which is a good Canadian show for Showcase. Just like Kenny Rose Spenny is a Canadian show. Uh, Trailer Park Boys, seasons one and two. The complete first and second season. Uh, a three-disc set. It's really cool. If you like Canadian shows and like things for Showcase. Check it out, people. Check it out. It's really cool. Now, as you can see, there's a, a, a filmer in the back, which probably doesn't want to reveal his face, but I understand that. Uh, the next season, let's see if this continues, uh, is My Name is Earl, season two. I need season three. I have season one. Great season. The second one's a good season. The third, I need to, that's the, just came out very, uh, like a week ago. It's really cool. you got to pick that up if you like the first season. Carry on to the next season. And the third one. Really good show, guys. The next one is a good classic, MASH, the ninth season, which, in my uh, opinion, for people born a little earlier than the 60s, in the 70s you probably watched this show, like once at least, or saw a clip. you got to say, you got to watch this. Ninth season, I need all, uh, I need um, season 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, and 11, which I'm probably just going to get the box set, because it's a pain buying all of them, it's too expensive. Sorry, guys, I'm just speaking. Sorry, guys. Next season, which is, in my opinion, from MTV. What? 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 That's okay. All right. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. I had a little interruption there. I thought I was going to die out or something. There. Sorry, guys. Let's continue. Uh, People of Bam, season one, which was eight bucks. Like, I hate getting eight uh, things that come with eight, eight uh, episodes. I don't like that. I like the whole... You know, I wish there were more episodes, but eight bucks, you couldn't go wrong for eight bucks for this season. Good season. Good, good guys. It's really cool. The next season is the same series that I was just talking about right here, Evil of Band season two and three, which has both, has 16 episodes this time and a bonus disc, as well as the first uh, season has a bonus disc also, just letting you know, with special features. It's cool if you like the show. Pick up the next season. The next two seasons that are together, and get the next seasons that are together also, seasons four and five, which are, uh, they're all right, I guess. I've never seen them all, but um, good. The next, uh, in my opinion, is an awesome show, and he's a great guy. Chris Angel, Mind Freak, season three. Now, season four just ended, and season one I need, and Halloween special I need, just added Chris Angel. Uh, had season two. But it's cool. It's from A and E. A and E does great eighties. Really cool. Do you like Chris Angel? I feel like that. Uh, the next series from MTV also. I like MTV's shows or old shows. Some of their shows are high. Jackass, which is, in my belief, an awesome box set for twenty bucks. Like, you know, you get this top ten moment. You get the book, which the book is, in my idea, like one of the best books you can ever get. Like the Jackass. Um, you get volume one, every scene, like, you see, you get more, more, uh, that you've never seen probably before. Volume two, three, and the bonus disc, which, special features are awesome on this DVD. You gotta check it out. Uh, yeah, let me just leave that there. Now on to the DVDs. The DVDs, uh, if this goes over ten, uh, ten minutes, or eight minutes, Eric, is it at eight minutes? No, um, sure. Huh?
if it goes over eight minutes, we're gonna stop it. Go to I'm gonna go to part two, and uh, we're telling you guys here, everybody here, we're going to part two. Not you know, we're just gonna start with part two. Um, we're gonna start with the DVDs now. I have more than this out of TV show and DVD. I just don't have them here. I want to show you guys, but it's a little. It would probably take an hour to maybe if I went slow and talked to it. Uh, um, Chuck and Larry, which it's not the newest Adam Sandler movie out anymore. Good movie, I guess. Uh, the next one is a three-movie comedy collection, which comes with Orange County, School of Rock, and Without a Panel, which, uh, they're cheap. Usually Paramount is like 10 bucks, anyways, but, you know, this was cheap, too. 30 bucks, I guess. So it was good, price. good little comedy collection if you like these three movies. Now, a good movie, in my opinion, Carlito's Wing, which, um, it's really cool, I guess, the movie. There you go. Cool. Check it out. The next one, which I believe is a good movie, but and it also has a good little case, bookcase. It's really cool. It's really cool. You guys can see this. If you can, don't be jumping. See? There he is. There's him with his little wax in there. Uh, it's a two-disc. I never had this burnt, but it didn't have special features. I like special features. The deleted scene. Right there. It's a two-disc there. And everybody, that doesn't know. These people that are new to DVDs and watching this. Alright. I'm just going to just handful here, guys. Make it worth your while here. The next movie is The Benchwarmers, which is a good movie, but it was an expensive price to get. Uh, if, if this goes over eight minutes, uh, just get, if it goes to eight minutes, give me a thumbs up. Alright? Just give me a signal. Alright, guys. Sorry about that again. Um, Benchwarmers, good movie. It's a little expensive, but you know. Alright. It's a really good movie. Um, yeah. Eric, if it goes over eight minutes, you can get a signal on the mm -hmm. next one. Yeah. Um, next one, we wrote to Perdition, which I haven't seen. It's in full screen. I don't know. I've never seen it. It was cheap. You buy cheap movies. You get that. You know, cheap movies. You get the craze for the movies, and you don't know what the hell it is. Sometimes. You never know. Next movie, Animal Rising, which I haven't seen. <coughs> It's all right. I don't know. If you guys have seen this movie, please send me an email and tell me how if it's good or not, or if it's a good movie worth watching, or if it's a shitty movie. Because it is. I don't want to waste my time. I might even watch it once and then maybe just, you know, never watch it again. You know, not sell them because I'm not an idiot anymore. To do that. Next movie is Fred Rock City, which Freddy Roxanne maybe enjoy this. May enjoy this. Uh, it's an alright film for anybody fans of Kiss or anything like that. It's fine. Eight minutes. Sorry guys again, sorry. This 